Good morning, Green Mountain. I'm Andrew, and these are your daily announcements for February 3rd, 2020. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Green Mountain. I'm Nick, and here's what's happening in clubs and activities. If you need help with math or science, there's help for you every Tuesday evening from 6 to 8.30 in the library classroom. Come meet with Lockheed Martin Tutors tomorrow evening. Today is Free Pizza Monday up at Concordia Lutheran Church, just north of Alameda, behind the Terrace Condos. Take a seven-minute walk to Concordia on Monday and enjoy some lunch and free pizza. Be careful crossing Alameda. February is Black History Month, and the IDEA Club is hosting a month-long celebration. To participate, you can check out all the posters around the building, and then you can attend one of the events happening all month in the library classroom. Talk to your teachers. You might even be able to earn extra credit for attending an event. Events are offered every period during ram and during RAM time, Tuesdays through Fridays this month. So that the IDEA can prepare, you'll need to get a free event ticket ahead of time and the information and ticket at the information and ticket table in the commons before school, during lunch and after school. That's it for clubs and activities. Now let's see what's happening in Future Center and Counselor. Hi GM, I'm Andrew and here's what's going on in Future Center and Counseling. Western Colorado University will visit with students in the Future Center this Thursday, February 6th during fourth period. Colorado Mesa University will also be visiting with students on Thursday the 6th, but during 6th period. Students already accepted to Mesa are encouraged to attend and go over the, the next steps of enrollment. Of, any, of course, any student who's interested in Mesa is also invited <coughs> sign up for both opportunities in the Future Center. That's it for Future Center, now over to sports. Good morning, Green Mountain. I'm your boy, Kenneth. Now, before we start this athletics announcement, I would like to uh, please ask you to give a moment of silence for uh, the $50 that I lost uh, this past weekend. Uh, I sadly bet against uh, the Chiefs, against my better judgment, and uh, I, uh, I would like uh, to give a, let's see, two-second moment of silence. All right, that's enough. Now let's get on to some more good news in athletics. On Friday, both boys and girls varsity basketball team showed the Wheat Ridge Farmers what a ramp can do. Hoorah! Our next game is Wednesday night against the Evelyn. Boys at home, girls at the Evelyn. At both schools. <clears throat> My bad. Level 3 jumps at 4 p.m. JV jumps at 5.30 and varsity tips at 7. See you there. And last but not least, congrats to the girls swim team for placing first last Friday. More specifically, Emma Neuroth on the 100-yard backstroke and 50-yard freestyle, and Peyton Oster on, on the 200 freestyle, being Stanley Lake and Pomona. Way to go, Rams! That's it for today. Back to you, Andrew. That's it for today, Rams. Stay saucy and go Chiefs!